Thanks, Alex. Well, you might know Dylan Loren because of her famous father, designer and American style icon, Ralph Loren. But daughter Dylan is a successful businesswoman in her own right. She's the founder of Dylan's Candy Bar Stores, and now she's an author of a book about her favorite sweet subject. Our own Becky Anderson sat down with Dylan Loren to discuss her new venture in this edition of Authors Revealed. Welcome to Authors Revealed. I'm Becky Anderson. We are so excited we have a really delicious treat for you on this show. It's the daughter of designer Ralph Lauren. It's Dylan Lauren with her new book. It's called Dylan's Candy Bar. Unwrap your sweet life. So what's your earliest member, memory of thinking that Besides just liking mm -hmm. candy like we all do when we're young, in our whole lives, actually. Yeah. But what was that first memory like, you know what, I, there's something more to this than just the taste and the sweetness. And, um, and, I do think, you remember that? I, I think there were several moments. Uh, probably, you know, I pitched Eminem Mars right out of college to do this uh, mosaic contest using uh -huh. their new 21 colors of M&Ms. Mm -hmm. And yeah. I thought all these different celebrities and their kids should make these mosaics with the color works. Yeah. And so I went to Mars and I showed them and I was like, you know what, I'm going to use this idea for myself. I'm going to have oh, this good. gallery of pop art and candy art and do candy and show all the new stuff. And uh -huh. that's sort of when I started going. Yeah. Okay, cool. Is there any particular holiday that you love decorating and, and working with candy? I love Easter because the, the bunnies, I, I collect rabbits and all the pastels and putting fake grass on the table. Um, Halloween actually is not my favorite because the color palette, but uh, okay. people react the most to Halloween because we had like, you know, really gross disgusting things and <laughs> adult parties they love the gummy rats and the chocolate cauldron and the candy corn votives and yeah. the you know wax fangs so there's something really in each holiday that's special yeah. okay what is it about some of the candy companies, and they keep going on, and that make them their candy classic, but are here for generations and generations? What do you think is the key to some of them? I think part of the key is the, they're family owned, and they uh. started with someone very entrepreneurial who believed in and was passionate about their product, and also is philanthropical. If you see that with yeah. Hershey, he does sure. that in Wrigley. So I think that that's part of it. I, it. When you go to these trade shows, it's like the Grand, great grandson of so and so yeah. is still running the company, so they have those, you know, good, you know, ways of running a company. Yeah. They treat their people well, and I think keeping the classic taste and the classic packaging, and mm -hmm. not trying to be trendy. And those companies have done that. And I think nostalgia candy is one of our biggest parts of the store because okay. yeah. uh, people love yeah. like, like being in touch with their childhood. Yeah. And if you could win a golden ticket, uh -huh. like Charlie did. Okay. What what candy company would you go to if it would be like a fantasy world, like Willy Wonka? I wouldn't be able to tell you that because all the candy companies would be <laughs> mad at me. They've all been so nice. I, I could, but I like your question. Yeah. I go to Dylan's Candy Bar. <laughs> okay, cool. That's a great. Well, Dylan, yeah. thank you so much. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Congratulations on the book. Thank it is you. stunning. It's so much fun. Uh, thank you very it. much. You. Okay. We've had a great conversation with Dylan Loren, Ralph Loren's daughter, about her new book, Dylan's Candy Bar: Unwrap Your Sweet Life. It was a real treat.